Hello, it's that guy who rocks here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make your um, computer. And this will work for anything, so either XP, um, 2000, Vista, or anything else. Uh, make it basically look like a Mac at the bottom, where it has all the apps along the bottom, which is really handy, and I think it looks really cool. So let's get into it. So first of all, you need to go into your internet browser and search Object Doc. Um, and then click on the first one that comes up. I'll put this link in the description to this website. And then um, just quickly click on free downloads. Um, and then basically click download. I mean, I've already downloaded it, but it's a simple installation. So just download it. If it, you may need to extract it if it's a zip file, but it depends. Um, apart from that, um, just download that, and that's pretty simple. So it might open it up if you've just installed it. But I'm just going to go ahead and open up mine right now. So I open it up. Alright, so here it is. Um, I've already got all my apps on here. And it's basically a matter of dragging and dropping apps onto it. So if I go in here and I, for example, wanted Windows Media Player, just click that and I can just drag it straight on, which is really handy. And then you can add as much as you want. Um, but I don't really want that one, so I'm just going to unpin that. Just simply like that. Um, you notice how. I mean, mine's disappearing because I've still got the settings slightly um, different, but you notice how this is in. You don't really need this if you've got this here because it's already at the start button and everything. So you just right click anywhere on the dock, click settings, and then give that a second to load up. There we go. Um, and then press settings again, and press hide the Windows taskbar. You can just do that again if you want it back and you want to uninstall that. But, um, that's basically it for that bit so you kind of set up I can just show you some quick features like um, you can add new shortcuts um, and things like that and separators which is basically a gap in between don't really know the point of them but um, you might want to fiddle around with it position position which is basically where you want it you can have it at the top left right bottom and so on uh, I've got mine centered because I think it looks cool and that's how it normally is um, Next, you can um, change the size of your icons and like how far it zooms in and stuff. I mean, I've got mine about the right size because if you do them too much, like I might need to change mine, you can tell how that goes off the side of the screen. But um, I've got a dual monitor, so it just goes over to there, so it doesn't look that bad. Um, you've got different things as well, like your background. Um, it says here mine's speedy. But all you need to do is press change background and you've got a load to select from. Some pretty cool ones but I just like the one that I've got now which is just the, um, I think it's the default one, if not it's the acrylic one. But that's pretty cool, I think you can download them off the internet as well if you look carefully. Um, next, got effects, you can have it just nothing, bubble which is basically bubbles as you go over it sort of. I got zoom which is basically like you can see if I hover over something it will follow it. Um, oh sorry I didn't click it yeah hover over it and it goes over it um, swing the swing the ones that you highlight and glow um, just highlight whatever right um, so that's about it for that um, accessibility this is basically so I like to put it keep it on top and show when mouse touches the edge um, I've got short delay and basically what that does is say I'm on um, Google Chrome, so they'll so I'm recording it, it's a bit laggy. Um, and basically, you can see how it's not there anymore. But if I put my cursor down the bottom, it appears and I've got all my apps. And the second I take my, hand, my mouse or, um, cursor off, then it disappears again, which is really handy so it's not in the way all the time. Um, you only you only it comes up when you really need it. And then you've just got your start button that's there, so you've got all your apps already there pretty cool but um for that's about it for this video so um thanks for watching if you've got any questions or anything leave them in the comments um don't forget to rate and subscribe if you like to um and peace out